Oh, okay. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> All right, let me see if I'm missing something. I don't have enough yeah, money to pay my bills. Oh my gosh, there's a girl right here. Yeah. Five thousand bucks. Six hundred seven. Wait, six thousand seven hundred and sixty-five. Boom. Eighty-two thousand three hundred forty-six money that I have. Oh my gosh, I'm rich. I'm richy. You gotta take a shower. know that my system is powerful enough to look um, open. Can you guess me? Oh, yeah, yeah. I was looking at the settings yesterday to see if I can change that and just load the whole thing, man. I did this house exactly like the one I had in Cuba, uh, uh, the, the one I grew up. This used to be my room. My room before it got built, uh, it was actually where my grandpa's car, like, a, you know, like a, a garage, you know, but an open garage. They would just park the car and that's it, yeah. And um, they made it into a room, like a master room because I had my own bathroom and everything. It was like this, exactly like this. Uh, there was a closet here, but you know, whatever. And the living room, of course, there was not a band practice over here. It was just um, the the reason I did this is because in this section we had a stereo here, and people would gather just just dance and you know, uh, and keep up. You know, we like dancing, so this area was like for music, and uh, we would watch TV here. Of course, it wasn't a plasma TV like that. <laughs> there was a division, like a little. It's decorating only. It's for decorating reasons, you know, but. It had a little section that, like that that divided the, the house. And now you felt like you were uh, in a dining area, you know, and the, the, the desk, it was a lot bigger. And, but it was just like this. And the kitchen was right here. And the kitchen is the one that, like, it, almost, it almost makes me nostalgic because it looks exactly like how it used to be. Although this thing would reach over here. I got to fix that. This is my grandma and grandpa's room. But um, I built it for my daughter in the game. And there used to be this uh, hallway here where we um, have the... Um, you know, storage for dirty clothing and stuff like that and blah, 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 you know. And there was this big bathroom. Uh, we had this big bathroom and, and not, not as big as this one, but it was big. It was unusually big. Uh, and it had a, a toilet and a duvet, one of those things that the women, the, 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 the toilet for women to pee or something. And it was this big shower, I remember it. It was, you know, it was amazing. I mean, I've never seen a bathroom like that. And this was my mom and, and dad's um, bedroom. The patio. Oh, it was a lot. There was a, a, a plantation here of... Um, Banana plantation uh, in the back of it. Uh, I think it would reach about here. You know what I'm saying? Here. And then there was a big portion of the patio over here, like that would reach uh, pretty far. That was the biggest one. But the the, the portion of the patio that the land that we own that I remember the most is this one. It was this big, exactly like this. It was because it has this beautiful guava tree here. We we used to have a lot of guava trees, like different kinds. This was like a, it looked like a pear. It was a kind of guava tree that it was a, as big as a pear. We had a guava tree here that was uh, acid. It was soury or something. It was very sour. And uh, like almost like a lemon, but in a good way. You know, sweet at the same time. Like a, it reminds me of a peach, but it was guava. And it was white inside. And this used to be my favorite tree right here. I used to play all the time. Instead of this, I had a swing set right here when I was a kid. And this tree, it was uh, chirimoya. It was my favorite fruit ever. I would just go up on that tree and spend the whole afternoon just eating. You know, sometimes. You know, not every day, but you know. These are our bikes. <laughs> Oh, do you make tacos? Yes, I make tacos. <laughs> tacos! Tacos! <laughs> Alright, let's go eat tacos. I made tacos just for you. Alright, put it on the whatever. <laughs> I'll okay. eat it. Nice. Okay, eat it all. Wow, well, oh. Okay. I don't know if I should no. take portion or take the whole thing. I'm gonna glitch out like the last time. Uh, take portion, then eat. Alright, let me see. Oh, I'm, yeah. I need a shower and everything. Holy crap. Okay, go, go to your room. Oh, okay. Alright, and something that I forgot to mention is that. Some people don't, I mean, most people in this game, well, that one is uh, an exception. You see, I like houses like that one 
like the one in front of us, because it has that flat roof, for example. I like that, that feature. Because that means that it's concrete, pure concrete. And in Cuba, houses were pure concrete. Um, there's like a lot of hurricanes and, you know, stuff like that, and you have to make your house concrete. It can't be like the United States, you know, made up of little paper and chirac and whatever. So the, the roof is like that, it's in flat. And some people, you know, because in the game, when you go inside the, um, the build mode... What? What, what happened here? Build mode. You must be in the flat, okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, if you go to roof, it's the cheapest one. That's not why I chose it. It's because every house in Cuba, the roof is flat like that. It's made out of pure concrete. It's, it is the hardest thing. You can build an entire, like, three houses on top of it. And that's what people used to do. For example, uh, my dad, this was my grandpa's house. And then my dad was going to build his house on top of it. And so on like that. There were families like that were built on top of each other. So the houses were really strong. They were like pure concrete. And that's why I chose that flat roof. You know, some people think like, oh, it's because he didn't have enough money for the roof or whatever. No. Actually, the flat roof is, in reality, is the best one. Uh, there's no snow, so you don't have to worry about, like, because uh, if, if, if this was the United States and you're living in a snowy area, of course, the snow is going to weigh a ton, you know, like, just snowing on top of your roof and it doesn't slide off. That's why in America, you know, they normally have that, um, what is it, this, this kind of roof? Uh, let me see, build mode. Um, this kind of roof, see? Because the snow would slide down and that, that's, you know, that's what you want. But in a place like Florida and stuff like that, this is the ideal one. Or Cuba or South America, whatever, you know, you want concrete. Because, <clears throat> uh, you know, we got so much hurricanes. and A hurricane in Cuba, they would say, like, oh, there's a hurricane coming. Blech. It's It doesn't scare people. It's like their houses can take all that, you know. The, the, the walls inside also. And here, this country, these walls would be made out of Chirac. No, in Cuba, it's pure concrete. I mean, literally, it, you can't touch the house. Like, I mean, a hurricane, five, uh, category five would do nothing to a house. And, and... But, uh, of course, unfortunately, not everybody in Cuba had, you know, um, take portion. Why am I? Oh, okay. I thought I, thought I took the whole thing again. <laughs> oh my god. All right. Take portion. There you go. Yeah, when I don't take the, the portion, if, if I didn't make the food, I think, it glitches out. It's raining taco. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh, this is your friend, sir. Yeah, they, they like it like this. They role play as kids. Oh what the hell goodness. does she want? <sighs> People. No, no, ignore her, ignore her. There, boom, she's blocked from my house. The bathroom, Wait, everything is nice. Move this. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. The bathroom is so pretty and everything. Yeah. All right, back in the yeah. Nice. Yeah. Um, you want to see some, some people? Uh, yeah, yeah. Coffee. <laughs> I was actually gonna drink real coffee right now because I'm. Uh, yeah. Here you go, the coffee. I'm gonna get a headache if I don't yeah, eat it. Here you go. Uh, drink. Okay. Um, let's see. What can I make for you? Hot dogs. <laughs> All right. <laughs> That's funny how you flip them and everything. <laughs> I like your house mostly because it's like it's cozy, and um, yeah. oh, we we haven't uh, gone to the uh, the basement and the gym and everything. Oh yeah, we have to, to go there. Uh, and everything okay. is so close by, like the rooms, everything is yeah, well organized. Yeah, at, at least it's not like big. No, I've but... seen some houses that are humongous in this thing. I'm like, dude, I know. you're one person. What the hell are you gonna do in that thing? That thing is boring. Yeah, like how is it big and there's nothing there? They yeah, wasted their whole entire money. Even if they put a lot of that other stuff, it's just one person. That's it. Here you go. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> huh. uh, Alright, let's, let's go down there. The the basement. It's this way. Alright, go. Oh, I like this dead tree. I'm gonna climb it. I love it too. <laughs> <laughs> it's just so funny. I like scary things. Okay, now let's play. Scary. <laughs> I always gotta be moving, and in real life when I play guitar, I'm the same way. I'm like standing, and I don't know. I can't stand like um, playing guitar and sitting down too much. How many, uh, stuff? Yeah, I like this gym. It has a little bit of everything. Athlete. Okay, I'm in level three. Yeah, it has everything you need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, no, I think the bike is faster, a little faster. Because yeah. I remember I was passing one of those jeeps the other day with my bike. Really? Yeah. Yeah, in Cuba, we used to do this a lot. Oh my god, it was like um, a thing, you know, like like that we did. Even at night, we would sit and talk and talk and talk and just talk like a whatever, about whatever. It's, you know, us Cuban peoples, we like to talk like a son of a bitch. And uh, we used to sit here and, and just spend the whole night. It was like 2 a.m. and me and my grandpa or whoever, you know, were visiting over, you know. It was a lot bigger, a little bigger than this. Like an entire family would fit, you know, another family also. And we would just sit and talk. It was nice. And, and, and this was a, 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 this street in front of it, it was like a main street, it was uh, 41, 41st, that's the main street in Gerona, where, where I used to live. So everybody would pass over in front of my house and say hello, and sometimes friends would pass by and be like, hey, yo, and then start talking again for hours. It was, it was a lot of fun. I miss that, you know. I miss Cuba. I know it's not the way it used to be. I mean, the house is not even there anymore. The government took it once we left. But it, so that's the story of this house. <laughs>